What are your thoughts on global warming? Um, it's such a complex subject, and there's so many different factors involved. And um, I think it's so hard for us as humans to know exactly what is going on or what isn't going on. Um, I think it's really, really important that as humans that we take good care of the earth and that we um, don't pollute and that we um, make sure we're using our resources wisely and recycling our resources when we can. And I think if we're doing all those things to the best of our ability, any impact we're having on global warming should be lessened. All right, thank you. So what do you believe is causing global warming? Um, I really don't know. There's like so many factors. You have the sun and the different cycles the sun goes through. Um, you have the fact that periodically the earth warms and cools. I mean, um, I come from an archaeology background, and so humans came over into North America because at the time it was a colder period of time, and you had the more ice frozen, so you had the Bering Land Bridge. But then eventually things warmed up, and um, that got flooded over, so now there's no land bridge, so now it's warmer now than it was then. So you've kind of got this, this cyclical approach to things. Um, I don't like that there's certain areas in certain countries that are um, polluting huge amounts, which aren't doing any good things for our planet. Thank you. Do you believe that pollution has anything to do with the cause of global warming? Um, yeah, I do. I think that pollution um, definitely is adding particles and stuff to our atmosphere that are, is not beneficial to our planet or to us. So what can high school students do to prevent global warming? Um, I think you need to be um, mindful of things that you're using, even things like your cell phones. That's got like a, a lot of um, rare elements and things in it um, that a lot of times we see the benefit of the technology so much, but we don't see the drawback in the fact of how it's being manufactured. So like, it's so hard to sit there and be like, this is good, this is bad, because there's good things about stuff, there's bad things about stuff, and a lot of times we just want to look at the good things. So it's hard to know. Thank you. Mm -hmm. So what do you believe about global warming will affect high school students? Um, I think that you guys, as um, you get older, you're going to have to be more conscious about what you're using and not using and how you're using it. Um, I think that there's going to also have to be a little bit of a revolution. Like right now we feel good when we're recycling stuff, but a lot of that recycled stuff, most of it's going to China. A lot of it falls off the barges on the way to China, and then we end up with all the plastic in the oceans. So here we are, we think we're being all virtuous by recycling, when really, sometimes it's not that virtuous. And also, now, I mean, China has started to put restraints on how much they'll recycle because they finally started becoming concerned about their atmosphere in their cities and stuff, and um, the pollution, and recycling the way they were doing it causes a lot of particles and stuff to be emitted. So now there's fewer places to recycle, um, at least in China, the stuff that we've been sending over there. But now that's opening opportunity up in places like Malaysia to start doing this recycling. But the reason it's opening up there is it's less regulated, so then you're going to have more pollution in those areas coming from the fact that we're recycling. So. It's just such a complicated question, and it's so hard to know all different sides of the issue. Global warming is happening. Humans are the cause of it. We've taken advantage of what the Earth has to offer. We've cut down forests, polluted the ocean with plastic, polluted the air with carbon dioxide. But luckily, there are some ways we can slightly prevent global warming. We can clean up trash and properly dispose of it. We can recycle, plant trees, stop using so much electricity, or try using solar panels. Some high school students are already participating. Some students at Watchup High School are responsible for recycling. A lot more people should take into consideration about what they could do to change the planet.